Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Grill Frilla, and I'm doing some demolitions. Um, finally, uh, I've had these on my computer for like a week now, I guess. But um, I'm gonna start commentating and um, posting these up. And what this actually is, though, this isn't just one of the normal demolitions. This is a special one. This is the Superior by Default Episode Four. And I'm still debating, this is first week on, I'm still debating whether I'm going to do the riot shield or not because it's, uh, it's tougher, it's a lot more tough to, um, to get a gameplay. I'm not sure how I'm going to do it, I'm not sure if I should do it by just score or by, um, uh, or kills I guess, but it's going to be impossible getting a lot of kills with that class. And <clears throat> right in here... Um, they got A. I don't know how they got A. I don't know what I team was doing, but it looks like I'm just playing with a couple friends. Two. I'm playing with two friends. I'm pretty sure Ant and Glenn. And that guy's getting chased like a mofo. But um, <clears throat> so we're. Ah, oh, hey, getting direct impacted. I've been doing a lot of games on Skid Row. Yeah, but um. Yeah, it's one of my favorite maps. Uh, I keep trying to get this point out, but I keep getting distracted by the gameplay. Um, the UMP. Um, like I've been having like a lot of debate in my own head, and I always I've been doing a lot of thinking about this. On, cause I, you guys probably know about how I talk about like overpoweredness and balance issues within this game. I always end up talking about like what guns are overpowered and what guns aren't overpowered and the community's outlook and my own personal outlook on it and <clears throat> from now on because my my favorite SMG is the UMP silenced and um to me I really don't think it's, it's overpowered unless you put stopping power on If without stopping power I feel like it's it can be worse than some SMGs that do have stopping power. Like the MP5K with stopping power, I think is a little bit better, or I don't know, more powerful than the um the MP5 I and mean, then the UMP without stopping power. <clears throat> it they're, they're similar when you put stopping power on most SMGs, but I I don't know. It's just really all about what you think. That's that's overpowered right here, right? Look at this. That's some bull. He could have killed like four people with that, with just that little clip. But to me, the UMP, it's really not overpowered in my opinion with, um, without stopping power. And, um, I do believe that there are guns that other people don't see overpowered. To me, overpowered guns, in my opinion, would be... Like guns that I think are obnoxiously overpowered, because I think um, there's a lot of overpowered guns. But well, starting off with power-wise, I think that the the um, the Scar H extended mags definitely is it's one of the most like overpowered guns, and it's, it feels unbalanced to me just because it's too. I don't know, it's just like, <laughs> you can kill so many people with one clip in that gun. And the person who uses that gun really doesn't have to have reaction time to do decent with it. Because it's, like I said, it's it's unfair and unbalanced. It's just, it's very noobish, I guess. You guys probably can be like, no, it's not noobish. But I really feel like it's a noob gun to me. Just because noobs love the scar. It's easy, it's super easy to use. It's pretty much like if UMP was an assault rifle, I think it'd be the SCAR. Because it's got the power, low recoil, it's easy to use, and I, I don't know, I, I guess that's it, but... Oh, this is crazy! What just happened? I guess I bounced a stun off a wall, and it hit some fool and killed him. So, <laughs> I don't know, that was crazy, that was awesome though. I was so confused when I did that. Um, I saw that guy hide in the corner, so that's why I hid and then jumped out. 
But anyways, um, yeah, to me the Scar Extended Mag is most overpowered gun. But then there's also things to me that make a gun unbalanced, because it's not just power that makes guns unfair and overpowered and unbalanced or whatever. To me, ACR is also like a newbie-ish gun, just because the recoil, if you're in like a firefight with someone, and I'm pretty sure you guys understand how like if you're, if you're getting shot by someone, your, your red dot or your iron sights, whatever you're aiming with, it's gonna like, it's gonna bounce upward. And um, it didn't happen in COD 4, but it happens in this game. Um, with the ACR, since it has like no recoil, when you're gonna be in a firefight with someone, there's basically gonna be like, they're not gonna suffer from that, and you are. So they have like a huge advantage. And the power really, people say that it's underpowered. I actually kind of think it's underpowered, but when people use it against me, like, it's, the power seems to be there. And maybe I just don't know how to use it, but it may be just one of those things where I hate when people use it against me, but, but, and I, because I suck with it, it might be one of those situations. But the scar is more like, you can, anyone can do good with it. It is an universal noob gun. Oh, right here, I cut out the middle part just to save some time on this video, because I hate making videos super long and drawn out. And I spawned with the Overwatch class with Danger Close, because I thought I had a Predator missile out first, and I was going to drop a Predator on them with um, Danger Close. You should always, uh, whenever you have a chance, you always should switch to Danger Close when you're using your kill streaks. when you have a chance. Don't don't purposely kill yourself in the middle of a kill streak just so you can you have a more overpowered second kill streak or something. I don't understand that, but I'm sure you guys wouldn't do that because that is very stupid. Because <clears throat> you always want to get build your whole entire kill streak. And um, yeah, so the whole power thing, like you see the PP2000, that's obviously overpowered. Everyone knows it's overpowered. I'm pretty sure everyone knows. Um, don't be excited if you can run around the game and do good with only your PP2000 or only your Rafika, because those are extremely un unbalanced. I'm not going to say... S the PP2000 is overpowered. The, the M93 Rafika is unbalanced. There's a difference. It has a, an appropriate amount of power, but the reason why it's unbalanced is because it's a secondary, and it's just as strong as the M16 and then FAMAS. And it it shouldn't have that capability as a secondary, in my opinion. Um, it's basically just putting a modded controller on an M9, in my opinion. So whatever, I still like the M9, still like the M93 Africa, but so I still think it's a little bit overpowered and or not uh, unbalanced. But also, what I want to say was all this stuff is all based on opinion. I don't know, it's because it's like an internal conflict that I'm having that's based on like ethics and then personal preference because there's like the ethics of you shouldn't be using the UMP because it's overpowered and noobs use it but that's also like saying you shouldn't use M16 from COD4 because it's overpowered and noobs use it but everyone still uses that gun like almost everyone uses that gun even the AK is pretty strong in that gun game and so is the MP5 but it seems like people like to just pick on one gun and I guess the UMP is that gun in this game um, but the whole like ethics and personal preference what I mean by that is like I think the UMP is not overpowered other people think it is a overpowered so should I use it or should I not use it see the thing is like yeah I should use it because it's my own because like it's my opinion like I do what I want but then also since I'm recording for YouTube I have like a, a standard I need to live up to for like my subscribers and they do subscribe to me and I do need to listen to them. If they don't want UMP, should I not give them UMP or should I not give you guys UMP or should I just do it because I think that's what I should be doing but I don't know. As of right now, I think I'm just going to start doing the UMP. If I get a lot of negative feedback on it, then I think I'm going to stop but this game plays over. I went 59 and something or 53 and something. I don't know. I did good though and I'll see you guys later. Peace.